Hey, it's John with Fix It with Foley, and uh, we're here in the backyard today doing some um, fall projects. And uh, one of the things that um, I was uh, given a, as an assignment to do was to fix up this old wreath. So this wreath had a lot of um, beautiful pears and stuff on it, but they're kind of cracked and faded. They've been out in the sun for too long, and I'm going to just give them a little spruce up. i got a couple different colors I'm going to try and mix with spray paint. Got to shake it up real good. So I don't know exactly how this is going to come out, but it can't be any worse than it is now. So we're going to check um, this spray paint. These little shortcuts are great because they're small cans. I don't have to use a lot. Um, so some people think pears look green. Some people think they look yellow. I think they look a little of each. So I got a little of each uh, color to kind of mix it up together and we're going to see uh, what we come out with. So. When you're spray painting, you really want to do light little coats. And uh, I'm going to start off here with um, just little, little light coats. And that's a little bit of yellow. And um, you can see if I spray just little light touches, it's probably all we need. And maybe just a little bit of green on the top because pear's not totally ripe. So I'll just do this other one real quick right here. And again, light. A little light green on the top maybe. And you see, it, because it's not totally dry, it's gonna blend together. So I might go back with a little bit of yellow. I guess I'm kind of like a graffiti artist here, but you get the point. It's like a mix of what works and what doesn't work. So. Um, We'll do a little more yellow, and we'll check back in a few minutes and see how, um, how the rest of it comes out. I've now masked off the rest of the wreath because I liked how it looked. Uh, I'm kind of working with the balance of the colors here um, to make it look kind of real, like something you might want to eat, maybe a yummy pear, but they're looking a little bit maybe psychedelic, but um, it's okay. It's, it's art, so I think we're good, and um, it should dry out. I'm not gonna touch anything. I'm gonna let it dry uh, in its place here, but um, I can always come back and touch up a little bit later on, and we'll see how they look. We have um, let our, there's still a little bit drying left to do, but they're, they're pretty good. I masked off all the areas. We did a light touch up with the spray paint. Just want to mention, I just used this old box, so all the the mist from the spray gets trapped inside. Uh, it's not windy out, so you don't want to do it when when the um, when it's blowing real hard, which it is right now. But we were able to get it, so um, it's a pretty good looking mix. They're kind of like a ripe looking pear, a little better looking than the um, cracked and faded pears that were on there. So I think we achieved. Um, Maybe we can re rescue this wreath for another season. At least the colors kind of stand out a little bit more. And um, we'll try, we collected a bunch of pine cones out in the yard. We'll try spray painting some of those later. Yeah.